Good morning, children. Let's begin chapter number seven, decimals. As we have already studied fractions, see this here. Out of ten equal parts, five parts are shaded. So in fraction, it can be written as five upon ten. Here also, out of ten equal parts, three parts are shaded. So it can be written as three by ten. So fractions whose denominators are ten, hundred, or thousand, they are called decimal fractions. For example, six by hundred, four by ten, seven by thousand. Now, if I want to write it in decimals, then we have to see how many zeros are there in the denominator. Here one zero. So we will count one digit and put decimal. So zero point five. Similarly here. One zero is there in the denominator, so we will count one digit and put decimal. So zero point three. Here also now here because two zeros are there, so we will count two digits. So one is six. Then nothing is there, so we have to put zero. So it is written as zero point zero six. Four by ten is written as zero point four, and seven by thousand is written as. Because three zeros, so we have to count one, two, three, three digits, and then decimal. So zero point zero zero seven. So numbers which are written in decimal form, they are called decimal numbers or decimals. Let's see one example: forty-seven point nine five. This part before this decimal is called as whole number part, and after the decimal, it is called decimal part. Now let's see place value table for decimals. Now before decimals it is same ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. After the decimal it is tens, hundreds, thousands. That means one by ten, one by hundred, one by thousand. So let's see some numbers here. If it is thirty four point eight nine seven. Now before decimal we have thirty four. It's a whole number part. So three four. Thirty-four. I have written after the decimal eight nine seven. So eight at tens place, nine hundreds place, seven thousands place. Similarly, this one six hundred forty. We have written before this decimal, and after the decimal zero tenth place, zero hundreds place, eight thousands place. So like this only, we have to write these numbers. In place value table. Now let's see types of decimals. Number one, like decimals, decimals having same number of decimal places are called like decimals. So let's see some examples: fourteen point eight four, seven point nine eight, sixty five point seven five. So after the decimal, we can see number of digits are two only. In all the three decimal numbers, so they are like decimals. Now let's see unlike decimals. Decimals having different number of decimal places are called unlike decimals. So here after the decimal three digits, here after the decimal two digits, and here one digit. So number of decimal places are different. That's why they are unlike decimals.